Is Taylor Swift's new song about Joe Jonas, her ex-boyfriend? We have the reasons as to why we haven't gotten Cardi B's new album yet, and BTS is coming out with a camping line. All of that and more are in today's episode of The Filter, so let's get into it. Taylor Swift has been gifting us with so much new music lately. Her latest release has been a song that fans believe is about her ex, Joe Jonas. The song is called Mr. Perfectly Fine from The Vault, which means that she actually wrote this song originally during the Fearless era, but she never released it at the time. So because of the timing of when she would have written it, fans believe that the song is in fact about her ex, Joe. There's a few lyrics that stick out, including one in the pre-chorus that says Mr. Change of Heart, which has people thinking that it could be about Joe since he notoriously broke up with Taylor and about a 25 second phone call. Sophie Turner posted about the song on her Instagram story and she said it's not not a bop and this is the wife of Joe Jonas so she's showing that even if the song is in fact about her husband she's still enjoying it either way. Taylor ended up reposting that on her story saying forever bending my knee for the queen of the north in reference to Sophie's character in Game of Thrones. If you've been feeling unproductive and just down on yourself for not accomplishing as much as you thought you would throughout the pandemic, you are not alone because Cardi B, she recently did an interview with XXL where she talked about how she planned to have most of her album done, but because of the pandemic and everything slowing down, her whole plan for herself didn't end up happening. She said when the pandemic hit, she really just stopped working on her album altogether. And she said she was discouraged by the idea of having to do a promo tour on Zoom and talk to everyone through a computer and just not be able to tour the album right away. She did say that she is thinking of just going away for a while in order to finish up the project, so we could see that happening. And Cardi also talked about the fact that she is in a racial wage gap. She talked about how so many Caucasian type of influencers would end up getting bigger paydays compared to her, who is an entire artist. She also said that she likes to go to her husband Offset for business advice since he's very good with numbers. This summer, you are going to be glamping in style thanks to BTS because they've released their own line of camping gear in collaboration with Helinox, which is a Korean-based brand. And each piece is the group's signature purple color. So fans are going to be able to buy everything from a folding chair to a camping bed, a table, bags, and even name tags. And this is actually a really good way to meet other members of the BTS army while you're hanging out in the woods. You'll definitely stick out amongst the crowd. A lot of the items are already sold out, which is not surprising at all. So if you do want to get your hands on some, you got to act quick. Thanks so much for watching this episode of The Filter. I'm Shannon, and we are making a big announcement coming up on our TikTok on Monday. So make sure you head over there, follow us on there so you can stay up to date with everything that is coming up because it's going to be very exciting. And in the meantime, if you do want to catch up on more music news stories, you can do so by heading over to our website, iHeartRadio.ca, or following us on TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, or wherever you want to find us on social media. Our handle is iHeartRadio.ca. We'll see you on Tuesday for the next episode of The Filter.